okay now why flows over apex right now we have been personally i am in salesforce and i started my career with salesforce um, technology and it's been six years i have been writing code all my life right so i've been writing apex code like anything and then we were told to you know use workflow rules in hand with apex use process builders and then came flow right and as soon as flows came and as soon as the automation era with this gpt coming in the picture for everyone and this open ai generative ai coming into picture everything changed and this has now become the era of automation everyone wants to look into how can things be automated people are super lazy now but at the same time they also want to work on smarter things on intelligent items not work on laborious items which are cumbersome which are tiresome which are something that need manual intervention but do not produce any specific value so everyone is talking about automation right and when everyone talks about automation we have to jump into that area at least to have at least so that we can sail our own boat right that's the primary idea we should not be drowning in the ocean we should be on the boat inside it and we should be sailing on it so it's not important that you sail the boat the very you be the very first person who sails the boat but you should be on the boat you should not be drowning so when it is the era of automation why not look into it and try to understand what all capabilities it provides and this is where we are using flows and this is why we are learning flows right why do i have to write code for something that can be done via flows just by drag drop point click and writing some logic why do i have to waste my time time is money time is important effort you can put that into use for something else right so in such scenarios wherein wherever you can use declarative approach wherever you can use out of the box approach right wherever you don't have to go custom that requires a lot of maintenance right any and every such place that applies to what i said in the last 30 seconds or one minute flows come in handy right so why write code why manage and maintain it why support it when you can write a declarative flow that does the exact same thing what your client needs right so flows are the next best thing in salesforce and are getting powerful with every release so now flows salesforce is promoting flows like crazy right salesforce is promoting flows like crazy and if you know flows you are a resource in demand right you don't have to know code you don't have to know any specific domain but if you know flow if you know how to write flow or configure flows you are a skill that's in demand already you are someone who can satisfy a simple sales cloud project or a simple service cloud project just by using automation using flows so that's the power of flows right so go with the flow right that's that's the bottom line go with the flow